Thank you very much. This is the last time you're torturing her life. This is the last time you're torturing her life. This is the last time you're torturing her life. I command you in the name of Jesus. I command you in the name of Jesus. Every power, every evil spirit, come at me. You cannot handle her. Don't come close. Jesus, today I'm set free. I close each and every door of sickness, of death. I'm not going to die. I'll be alive. My feet are released. My soul is released. Jesus, take my life. We found you in bed. How are you feeling now? <laughs> Have I fought with you? <laughs> yes, you fought with me. Oh, sorry. No. As I was praying for her and demons were manifesting, she was unconscious and could not realize that she was fighting me during the time of deliverance. So she was saying, sorry. How do you feel now? <laughs> we came when you're sick in the bed. But how do you feel now? My hand is heavy. You know why she's feeling is pain because she's been using this hand to beat me while she was unconscious. If that man touched her, would have seen another battle. It is amazing how God healed this lady. We found her bedridden, but as soon as we finished praying, she gained strength and even went to the kitchen to cook food. What a wonderful God. Not all sicknesses are for medicine. Some need deliverance for us to see God.